welcome back to Emerging Magazine's Inside Edition. This time we're here with Alvaro Orlando, also known as Cosmo, who is the winner of this year's The Pickup Artist on VH1. Wow. <laughs> <laughs> Latino smoldering good looks. That's Explain right. to us about that show. It was a show about um, picking up women, but it taught me so much more. It kind of um, taught me how to be more confident and how to own my power and uh -huh. just be happy in my skin you know like before I would walk around and I was so like shy and introverted and ashamed uh -huh. to even talk about like what was good about myself you know and the show just taught me everything how did you get on the show what was the process <laughs> of, of it was so random yeah my, my whole life I've never had a girlfriend my whole life and I know everyone's like shut <laughs> up lie. Really? I've never had a girlfriend really? my whole life before the show now that the show yeah, is you're beating them back now, the now they're breaking down now, walls. <laughs> <laughs> now I have like out of like 39 or 40 but um, oh my no no I'm playing okay Minus a player 10. no <laughs> but um <laughs> I they called me out of nowhere they just said hey uh do you want to do the show about um shy guys they, they were feeling bad for you no like they, 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 <laughs> I, don't, I have no oh. idea they saw me on they saw me like on uh audition about maybe four months prior to the show oh, okay. okay and they were like hey um do you really have problem picking up women? And I'm like, who is this? Grandma? <laughs> <laughs> I'm like, grandma. They're like, no, this is not your grandmother, Alvaro. Um, we want you to come in for an audition. I'm like, my name's Alvaro, and are you sure you're not my grandmother? They're like, no, and come in for an audition. I went in, and I saw a bunch of, like, nerds and people with math books and glasses, and I'm like... Math books and glasses? Really? Yeah, well, they were, like, very nerdy, and here I come with, like, a bandana and a hat to the side, and, like, I'm a break dancer, and I've been boxing, and I have, like, the cool walk, oh. and they're like, what are you doing here? You you don't have problem picking up women, and I'm like, <laughs> shut up, I do! <laughs> <laughs> it's always on the inside, you know, like, on the outside, everyone's like, oh, you know, especially if you're Latino, women expect you to be Don Juan DeMarco. <laughs> And when you say amen. something like, amen, right? <laughs> when you say something like, hi, I like your shoelaces, they're like, what? You're not Latino. Where are you from? You know, it's <laughs> like I have all this pressure on me. I, you know, I'm good looking, I'm Latino, and so women are like, okay, you have to know how to talk to women, you know? But now you're like, no problem now. No, like, no you, problem at Drop all. of a dime, Yeah. pick a woman out of a room, pick her up, yeah. no problem. Yeah, like a charm all right. it, it, it just teaches you how to build confidence, you so, know? So you and know yeah. what that means, right? What? Pick yeah, me up. Yeah, yeah. You gotta pick me yeah, up. Yeah. You know, and I get this, <laughs> and I and I get this maybe like twenty-five to thirty times a day. People will come up to me, and they're like, g "Women will be like, hey, are you Cosmo from the show?" Yes. yes. Pick me up. You're like, that is no. the number one thing that women say to me. And, uh, and this is I was excited when uh, I saw when I saw the bio. I was like, "Oh, I'm so getting picked up. This is gonna be great." And <gasps> this is how the game starts. You know, I um, okay, so like, the game. Yeah, the, well, social dynamics, it's yeah. human behavior, we ca mm -hmm. they call it the game. You know, if, um, first of all, if I was to pick you up, I, I wouldn't pick you up because I'm more of like a blonde person with blue eyes, so you're not my type. Oh, but, oh, if, oh. but if I was to pick you up, which you're, you're beautiful and all that, but you're not like, I feel like, okay, beauty's I common, right? I feel inadequate. No, 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 no. Like, uh, look, we, I moved to Hollywood, right? I'm from Miami, right? A bunch of beautiful uh, women all yeah. over the place. You're yes. beautiful, right? I, I'll give that to you. Let's clap. You're beautiful. <gasps> what do you have Rock going for you? What do you have so going close. for you more than your looks, though? Like, besides yeah, I, I the beauty. Yeah, I got nothing. <laughs> nothing? Nothing. At all? I got nothing. Oh. I've got you. I'm, I'm hosting the show with you. I'm very excited. Oh, uh, okay. <laughs> well, this is how it would kind of start, like, the the trying to make her evaluate herself and then I mean you wouldn't tell a self-conscious girl hey you're ugly but you can tell a beautiful woman you're not beautiful to lower her value down you know and you're just kind of like you know <laughs> playing with the values you know <laughs> <laughs> and by the way by the way that black black hair and Latinas are my type but women always want something so you they just say the opposite they, they, they want something um, they can get you yeah. walk so into a room with a Excuse me while I take some notes. I'm sorry. <laughs> <laughs> oh, get a pen. You got a pen? Oh, right. You know, you walk into a room with a girl, and they're like, the women are like, oh, wow. Well, what does he have that, that I, well, I want him. Yeah. Well, I can't get him because he has a girlfriend. Yeah. You know, they, we call that being pre-selected, walking in with women. So when I go to clubs, I walk in with two. Or so are you, like, writing a book after wow. this? Like, I feel like you should be offering seminars or something. I didn't even know it was, like, such an art. We are doing it. We're doing seminars. The winner of the show... Um, which is me, got um, $50,000, and uh, I get to go all over the world traveling with um, the First you had to show. stop here, which I totally understand. <laughs> but then, <laughs> then after that, you go. Yeah, I'm, I'm going all over now, and I'm enjoying life, and, you know, 
for the first time in my life, I have more than $200 in my bank account, so I'm happy. That's awesome. Yeah. So Congratulations. So tell Thank us about you. any upcoming future projects you made. Well, I have, um, prior to um, the pickup artist, I hosted a show on New York called The Roof, and everyone right now found out that I'm an actor. Like, I have a lot of fans. I thought the show was going to be Mickey Mouse. Oh, my God. It, I get random phone calls because my number was leaked down the internet. <gasps> I get maybe uh -oh. like 10 or 15 random phone calls a day by girls. They're like, hey, can you meet me on Hollywood and Highland? <laughs> I, I, I'm, I'm so pretty. I'm your type. I just want to talk to you for five minutes. Like, I get Cosmo, random phone Cosmo, calls Cosmo. all the time. It oh. is definitely time Yo. to change your number. <laughs> right. Thank you so much for being on the Thank show with us so today. Thank you so much. I know yes. I learned a lot. I, I hope the rest of you did, too. I did. Thanks for coming. No problem. <laughs>